Now at 5 on KMTV, mourners in Council Bluffs are missing a friend, a co-worker, and a mentor. Police Lieutenant Ben Roth died on Saturday from colon cancer. He was just 38 years old. His funeral was today. Reporter Joe Kadat is live in Council Bluffs with some of the touching tributes. Joe? Craig, what we heard from people close to Lieutenant Roth over and over again was his tremendous capacity to mentor officers. He also had a great sense of humor and was very good at training officers. Take a look. In Council Bluffs, Lieutenant Ben Roth was a mentor. He always used to say to recruits, you know, when you're treating some, talking to somebody on the street, talk to them like you want your mother, sister, brother, uncle to be talked to. You don't have to be a jerk. In the 18 years Sergeant Bo Wake worked with Lieutenant Roth, Wake says Roth never complained, not once, no matter what time of day, what the weather was like, or how dark the task ahead. The thing I'm always going to take away from with, with this with Ben is that he always made me laugh. Um, I can recite every single one-liner from Anchorman 20 times over because of that guy. That positive outlook left its mark on the community too. He loved coaching kids. He loved being a positive role model for kids in their lives. There's so many things, and a lot of those things, quite frankly, are personal between him and the people leading him for. And every person we met on the street says they'll miss Lieutenant Roth. It means a lot to the community. I mean, another good officer is gone. This world needs good officers. And as a community, this is a really hard, hard day. It's, it's emotional. And it takes pride, a lot of pride. While Roth's impact on the department, on the community, will live on, Sergeant Wake says Lieutenant Roth's shoes will be hard to fill. We'll carry on. It's going to be, I won't say business as usual, because we're going to carry Ben with us. But we are going to carry his legacy. We're going to carry the way he handled himself. We are going to give, you know, keep giving back to the community the way he did. Earlier, the streets in Council Bluffs were lined with people showing their support for the police department and, and the lieutenant who passed away. There was an elementary school nearby the service where students were outside with signs saying messages like thank you and messages that they would give the lieutenant if they could thank him today. Reporting live in Council Bluffs, Joe Kadat, KMTV Action 3 News. We have spent a lot of time on